Hello, everyone. My name is Carmen, and this is a testimony of a miracle that I experienced at Christ the Healer. So on top of being healed of Graves' disease, which is a thyroid issue, I got when I was 25 years old. I was at a Bible camp, and I was just really sick. I lost like 30 pounds in three weeks, and I like... Yeah, when I went to the doctor, they told me I had Graves' disease, and when I went on medication, I actually was put on way too med much medication at the beginning, and uh, I gained 60 pounds back, and it was all within under three months, and so I was just at a very unhealthy state, and uh, yeah, I was really dependent and reliant upon medication to regulate my emotions. Graves' disease really does affect your uh, your emotions as a woman. And so, yeah, I experienced miraculous healing when TJ came to Saskatoon to Christ the Healer, uh, in November of 2022. And I have been so grateful ever since. There's also been a couple other things that I have experienced miraculous healing from and deliverance. One being, uh, the spirit of rejection. I, I had had a lot of hard rejection things happen, whether it was relationships, friendships, uh, just things that had happened to me in the past that I was allowing to like take hold of my heart. And, uh, and it was through prayer times with, with people from Christ the healer and going to the altar that I experienced true deliverance from that spirit of rejection. I remember when Fadi was praying for me one time, he was just like, and I just pray that the spirit of rejection would leave and that you would know your worth, Carmen, know that, uh, you have been fearfully and wonderfully made and people's opinions of of you don't don't matter it's god's opinion of you that matters and i feel like that has set me free in many different ways even leading worship just relying on god and not my own strength relying about what he says about me and not what other people say about me and so it's been really freeing and uh, i'm really grateful for that freedom and then yeah, before I started coming to Christ the Healer, I was on a medical leave for depression and I was on depression medication. And uh, yeah, I I feel like I was going back into depression. I, I experienced freedom when I went on a trip to Morocco and I experienced God's mercy and grace and realized that he loved me again. And uh, that was one thing that the enemy tried to steal from me is that everybody hated me nobody loved me. And it was such a lie. <laughs> and uh, even a 1% lie is still a lie. And I was believing that of the enemy that I was worthless. And that's what pushed me into depression that and being rejected by a guy, it was just all combined. And so I was on medication. And I decided to go off that medication and just rely on God to be my strength uh, when I'm weak. And uh, through my time at Christ the Healer, I really learned to combat the enemy's lies, like to actually talk back to the enemy when he starts to talk to me and tell me that I'm worthless, that um, I'm just going to be depressed for the rest of my life, that I'm never going to make a difference, that um, I'm in ministry. I work as a youth worker at youth for Christ and like work in ministry. And I'm just going to be a failure that, that I was able to combat those lies with, with truth from the word that, that I am who God says I am. I am a child of God that, uh, I am loved I am, that he's never going to leave me or forsake me. And so, yeah, I was freed from going back into that pit of depression as well. And that was just through the amazing teaching and preaching that I've experienced at Christ the Healer and the many different personalities that Pastor Terry and, and Shelly bring into this place. I've been so grateful for people like Dr. Charles, TJ, people who have been able to call out the truth of the word. And uh, yeah, I'm just, I'm really grateful for the freedom that I've experienced from rejection, from Graves disease, from depression, and uh, I will never be the same. And I'm super grateful for this place. And if you're looking for a place to call home,
you should probably check out Christ the Healer. The people here are amazing. And they just, uh, they have such a heart to serve people, such a heart to uh, see deliverance and healing happen in people's hearts and to be set free by the truth of the gospel. 